Really? There's no way he could have survived that, right? Oh my god, Charlie, you mother... You mother... Beautiful, brilliant man, you. Charlie, I never thought I'd be so happy to see you, Charlie, after all this bullshit you've done. All the bitching and moaning and getting us into this bullshit. Mother Charlie. Rising from the grave. Mother Charlie. Motherfucking Charlie. <laughs> Alright, let's go get him killed now. <laughs> oh boy. Charlie, Charlie. want to stop playing we'll do one more section Is this oh great <laughs> an oval great thanks we may may be able to buy a pack of cigarettes with this stuff waiting for the jump scare. Oh, this wasn't open before, was it? No, oh, this is where I came from. It was open. Well, where do I go? You can't do this lock? Would you stop with the creepy music? Maybe we could push. Pull. This is too creepy, man. This is way too scary. man oh we haven't checked our stuff in a while Kate found a book by Joe Morello the author's picture is the man who ferried them to the um, island 
Oh my god, so many secrets. FBI badge. The badge belonged to Hector Monday. An ID card. Hector Monday joined the FBI Behavioral Science Unit in 1989. His photo has been redacted. A photograph of a group of young recruit or new recruits at FBI training. One of their faces has been redacted by a thick black marker. The man obscured in the photo is probably Hector Monday. An article cut from a local newspaper. Manny Sherman's corpse was stolen from its grave. By Hector Monday. Psychological report about Hector Monday. There was concern that about his mental state as he had become obsessed with the killer that he was investigating. Hector was investigating the Chicago killer at the time. An animatronic of a woman. Real body parts have been used in its construction. It's the whole... It's the woman from the vacation photo. The woman is Michelle Morello. She was murdered by Dumet. Oh, shoot. Hold on. Okay, I'm being urged to hurry. The write, A writing journal containing an early draft of a new book by Joseph Morello. There's a, a photograph of him on the back. Joseph is a man that the, um, met the crew on the ferry impersonating Dumet. Real human teeth found inside an animatronic head. A tape from an FBI... Interview between Monday and Manny Sherman. Monday assaulted Sherman. And... Oh, is that it? Okay, I guess that's it. Okay. I hope I get to a checkpoint soon. Otherwise, we might have to... Just restart this one. Find a way out of the workshop. Find a way to power the workshop. You know what? Maybe I should just stop here. I think I'll just stop here because I don't know how long this section is going to be. Some of these are long. <sighs> All right. So one dead, Charlie alive, and return tomorrow for more of me freaking the fuck out. Oh, we were supposed to turn on the power or something. Find a way to power the workshop. Well, I can't see anything. This should help. Not a real person. push stuff that I don't know what it does? I don't have to do anything, okay? I, I don't have... I can shut off the game if I want to. Shut it down. Shut it off. Carteroid... Artery, injection site, liver, gallbladder, stomach, pancreas, light contraction, extra ocular muscles, oh, the eyeball, jaw, rising or finish hinge, shin, thinner material. That, so this, he's figuring out how to take these human parts and combining them with the robotic parts i think how to how to put the uh put them together
Okay, we do not want that to happen to us. Warning. Automated waste disposal unit. Riding on the conveyor at any time can cause severe injuries. Entanglement hazard. Remember to switch off and lock out. Stay clear of the moving belt. Evacuate via the immediate emergency ladders. Caution. Conveyor may start without warning. Are we going to have to go in there? Switch off and lock out. This is my way out. Oh man, Charlie, I'm sorry. You tried so hard to survive. I'm not sure if this is like a quick time event to survive or if this is a... Get everything straight before you go in to survive, you know? What is what do these things do? We have to see. Please. Please. These have oh, nothing to do with the conveyor belt. Well, that's all very not lovely at all. <sighs> okay, I think we just need to be ready with our squares and X's and, and triangles. Yeah, I can't even turn it off. There's nothing else for me to do. No, I don't want to. Don't make me do it. I'm sorry, Charlie. I tried. This is square. This is circle. This is X. Circle. Square. Hide, 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 hide. I mean, there's nothing back there, right? Charlie doesn't look too good. <laughs> oh my god. 
That was not fun. Shit. God. I'm gonna piss myself one of these days. What the hell is this? Pleased to see you too, Kate. Glad you're alive. Listen, I found out some new information. What? That guy on the ferry? That was not Dumet. That was Joseph Morello. He's a true crime writer. I found one of his books. How's he wrapped up in this? I don't know. In one of the bedrooms, there was a body, a woman. She'd been decapitated. It was Joseph Morello's wife. I saw a photo of her. She was called Michelle. So we're not his first victims. Have you seen Mark? Not in person, but I spotted him on one of these monitors. Thank God. I was worried sick about him. But I also saw Dumet running around. God. Hurry, go! Hurry up! Jesus. What is all of this? He's got video feeds. Recording decks, a mixer big enough for countless mics. He's watching everything. It's more than that. He's got utilities running through here, hydraulics, electrics, everything. He can control the whole building from here. How far down does it go? This all connects. This is how he's getting around the house. How are they talking so calmly right now? They just saw him. Like, he just passed by them. Charlie would say this guy is a fractured psychic. That he's wearing a mask to put what he's doing on a different personality. That's probably just his theory because he can't reconcile a human doing this stuff. I think it's a mistake to say he's just crazy. He is in full control of what he's doing. He's just not wired like the rest of us. That's not crazy. Take a look at this. What is that? The guy we saw murdered. Was it set up? There was no groundskeeper. We saw a guy in a yellow jacket with her stuff. I guess that was Mr. Demet. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking too. Crazy implies out of control. Look at this place. I can't this move. This is methodical. You're in my that's way. not crazy. No. Hello? Wait, oh, he's wearing a mask you. as part of the performance. At best, maybe he's insecure about something and it gives him confidence. Insecure? Like, low self-esteem? Is he uncomfortable at parties? Does, did his mommy not hug him enough? Mm. He's been tracking us since we arrived. Mark was last seen in the basement. Oh, Bad parenting Aaron. can definitely be a factor, but it could be a shitty dad just as much. Or an uncle, any adult figure, really. Don't you read any of our research? Mm, I just set up the lights. <laughs> I just work here. I'm sure he fits the profile. Bullied as a kid. Chicago Police! Mr. Monday, this is Chicago Police. Can you open the door, please? Mr. Monday, I'm Officer Stanley with Chicago Police Department. Can you hear me, sir? Oh 
Oh my. Wonder who the body it was. He likes being in a position of power, especially over women. Okay, cool, but why? Lots of people put up with that stuff and don't turn into killers. Aside from the unhealthy obsession with H.H. H. Holmes, he's copying the M.O. Clearly, he identifies with Holmes somehow. Can we use this gear to find a way out? Maybe we can open those shutters in the lobby. Subject, my order from Amber Harris to Brandon Day. 2017. Thank you, Brandon. I have instructed... Oh, wait. Let's, let's go in order. Let's see. June 6th. One forty six, ten thirty eight, eleven forty one. Do I start from the bottom or the top? Good morning, Brandon. I can assure you that all of our custom masks are very robust. They are often used in long running theater productions and film and filming inten intense action scenes. The material used for your mask is a plastic resin coated wood, which provides a toughened strength and is highly durable. The co total cost would be. 1800 plus tax can you let me know if this is acceptable and i will instruct our pro our maker to proceed how many um how many masks is he ordering brandon day is that like an alias good morning amber thanks for your reply and putting my mind at rest yes the cost is perfectly fine please go ahead reminder this should remain confidential Thank you, Brandon. I have instructed our maker to proceed. We will keep you updated on progress with photographs at each stage as promised. As discussed previously, we'll keep the production uh, discreet. Okay, I think I looked at everything here. Where did she go? Oh, she's right there. Why is she not following me? Like, why do they just want to get separated so badly? I don't understand. They're always just running off. H.H. Holmes Costume Recreation. Recreation. Oh, there you are. What is this? Hi, Mr. Monday. This is Lucinda Price from Twilight Prairie Care Home. I tried to call you a couple of times. We, uh, I, I understand that you're making voice recordings of your mother, and we do believe you're supporting relatives, and, and of course, you want to capture the precious memories. But, uh, we've had some complaints from some of the other residents who are disturbed. Disturbed by the volume. Oh my god, what was... So he was going to like the, um, the, the senior home or wherever she was staying and recording, like, recording her, her voice and whatever, but he was doing some disturbing things. Maybe he was hurting her. Maybe he wanted recordings of like her screaming for some reason, or he was just saying really uh, vile things, or I don't even know. And I don't want to know. 
and hi Cory and hi Janice and hi Joe and hi Minerva oh okay let's um inspect this over here look at this it saw his little tricks and moving walls and crap nothing in the shit box is real he controls everything from here it's a murder factory you're right break everything we should use this against them all right what's your plan okay look He's in here, right? So we get him to go down this hall and we trap him between these two moving walls. There's no other way out of there. He'd be stuck. Okay. But how do you make sure he goes down that hall to begin with? One of us is going to have to be bait. Oh! No, no way. It's too risky, Jamie. So is letting him run free. I'd say that's more dangerous. Come on. There's no second chances here. It's my plan. I'll be the bait. If you're sure, just... If it looks like it's going south, get the hell out of there. No argument here. You should take it. I need that. What did she... Well, if she's going to be the bait, then Jamie should take it, whatever it is. Is it her, um... Oh, the screwdriver? I mean... Either one of them could could need it. We don't know how what's going to happen, but I guess um you could use that as a weapon if need be. I'm going to hang on to it. I'm more likely to need it. Watch, Kate is the oh, one who needs it. That's enough of a moment. Let's do this. Stick to the plan. Obviously. So how do we get out? Third floor must be a work in progress. Okay, be ready. You're gonna have to time it right to trap him and not me. All right. Here goes nothing. <sighs> no. <gasps> okay, guys. Rest in peace, somebody. Rest in peace, somebody. Head down the hall. Keep to the right. Six. Is this the work in progress floor? Was this on the map? I don't know. I couldn't read that damn map. You are definitely braver than me, girl. Damn these mirrors. These freaking mirrors, man. More rooms being built. Huh.
god. Fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. Fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. <laughs> What is this thing? Where'd he go? Fuck. Okay, I don't see anything to inspect or anything. So, we go this way. This is a dead end. I'm lost now. Oh, wait, did I try this door? Uh. Shit! Damn it, bitch! There goes our screwdriver. I got distracted because... Can I get a do-over? Okay. Whatever. The screwdriver didn't even help! I got distracted because I thought her saying do it now was something different from what it was. So like, as I was processing that information, the quick time event came up and then I, I just, I panicked and I pushed the wrong one because I thought she was like goading him on, like, come on, like, come at me. And then she said, close the thing. And I was like, I, I didn't know if I said it at the wrong time or whatever. So yeah. I don't even care anymore. This game is too scary. I just want it to be over. Shit. And now she's gonna die because she doesn't have the screwdriver and it's like two at once now. Great. You know what? I might as well just give get everyone killed on purpose at this point. <gasps> Run! Something? Why are you just standing there? Get away! The first quick time event I missed. So stupid. I don't want to 
hear it! What an excruciating way to go. I suppose Kate and Jamie just weren't on the same page with their plan to catch Dumet. Deep down, Kate will always know she played a part in Jamie's death. It's not the first time she's let down a friend of hers like that. It's a catchy tune, isn't it? Erin's Don't Be Scared song. Sadly, it didn't work. Meanwhile, Charlie has proved himself capable, surviving now. the furnace and every other obstacle. Who would have thought it? Did the hint I gave you earlier help? No, it never does. Perhaps you'd like another. Yes. <laughs> Let's see if Sir Arthur can help this is from the man with the twisted lip have you read it you should a trusty comrade is always of use and a chronicler still more so i think that last bit might refer to me you should get back i hope these chats are helpful i certainly wouldn't want them to be intimidating I'll be watching your progress, as always, watching very closely. Mm hmm oh, Man. <laughs> Not feeling very confident now. No. There we go. Three alive. I think I do better with the Xbox controller scheme <laughs> he's gonna come to the other window oh my god
I don't know. I don't know. And if I pick the wrong one, she's gonna die. And there's no way for me to know. If I had the screwdriver, I think I could hide. If he did, if he did come, then I could stab him. But if he, I'm cornered if he finds me. So I think I have to run. Or it could be that if I hide, he doesn't find me. He gets distracted by something and goes somewhere else. And that's how I'm safe. I don't know. It would be a dick move if you get all that quick time event and heartbeat stuff and then you get killed by a wrong decision. That's how this game is. You can do everything right and then one wrong decision and your character is dead. And my gut is telling me to run because if I hide and he comes then I'm dead. But if I run, maybe there's a chance. I don't know. Fuck. I'm probably wrong. Okay. I'm not immediately dead, but they're giving me another decision. Oh, God. Alright, give me some more heartbeat shit. I can do it, I think. I don't know. I tried to pull out the amethyst, but I, um, I pushed the wrong... now. I was still pressing triangle. I didn't know I was done pressing triangle. Is she dead? I'm getting sick of this. I'm seriously getting sick of this bullshit. Why did they put us another prompt like so fast after? Fine. <laughs> I, don't, I don't understand. We're not doing the heartbeat shit again, are we? Oh my god, we are. Too much heartbeat shit in this damn game. Okay. You get the feeling it's easier to save some characters than others? Yeah, I think so. I definitely think they, they definitely do this. I mean, otherwise... 
there would be a lot of people that probably just ha kill everybody off. <sighs> okay. All right, we get to relax for a little bit. I mean, if if we can call this relaxing, I guess comparatively so. Uh, I feel like I'm playing Resident Evil 4 right now. Except I don't have, like, a, a shotgun and a rifle. And there's, there's, um, considerably less dogs. Through a maze? off do we have here? I guess this maze was a cute garden feature once. So I'm trying to get to the the front gate here and I'm here or what? So I have to go <laughs> um those are all gates who knows if they're open or closed there's another open gate there. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not even gonna try to like memorize that or anything. I don't even know where I am. No. Oh, this is a dead end. Okay, you know this what? This is supposed to be a way out. D stop freaking out, girl. I need you to just keep your composure. <sighs> I know he's your son, but I married you for you. Not your son. Besides, it's ex-wife's responsibility to stop him from doing stupid things. Not mine. Oh, I don't know. I think I'm maybe just depressed already because of this trip. It's not what I had in mind when you said you were taking me away to a secret island. I don't care if he is Harrison Lee, the f famous horror fic fiction writer. You only work for him. You don't have to go on vacation with him, too. Can we spend some time, just the two of us, Cecile? Dear Kurt, I thought it would be easier to write this down because I get upset when I try to talk to you about it. I'm in distress. You know I don't get along with Thomas. I just don't get why we have to take him everywhere with us. By your own admission, he is a fucking nightmare, and it's getting me down having him around all the time. Okay... Thomas is the son of Kurt and Cecile. Well, no, no, no. Thomas is Kurt's son, but not Cecile's. From a previous m relationship. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know who any of these people are. Where did I come from? I guess I came from here. Oh, 
Okay. Bro, I can't see. That might come in handy. Can we take this with us? Oh, I can. Sweet. What do these do? Fuck it. What did that do? I think it has no power. <clears throat> Follow the wires. I can't I can't see anything. even know where I was going, but I found something. Uh, but I can't do anything with it? Find the missing electrical switch? Oh my god, you have got to be fucking kidding me right now. Where the fuck? Can I use the drawer part I picked up? Oh, you're saying I probably, I might already have it. I forgot about that. You probably saved me a lot of time. But then again, it's not giving- wait. It is giving me the option to use it. Thank god. You saved the day. I can't turn it off? I can't turn the music off? Oh my god. Go. Go, go, go. Oh, it's another bar. That's weird. Good morning, Chicago. 
We begin today with some breaking news. Chicago police today confirmed the body of a man found in a fire at an abandoned warehouse in the Fulton River District to be that of missing FBI agent Hector Monday. Monday has been identified as the shoeshine killer whose recent killing spree struck fear into the hearts of locals in and around Chicago. What? A spokesperson for Chicago PD confirmed Monday murdered four victims, including yesterday evening police officer Patrick Stanley, a dedicated veteran of 22 years. The fire was brought under control shortly before 5 a.m. this morning. The body recovered at the scene was burnt beyond recognition, but police identified Monday from dental records. Wait a minute. The body was burnt? It might not have been Monday's body. I still think he's the one who's here in the house with us. The one who's doing all this. I still have a feeling it's him. I don't know who D Demet is, but I think it's a made up name or something dental records yeah he could have put anybody's teeth in there he had plenty to choose from or he could have put his own teeth i don't know you know what i'm saying come on guys think creatively <laughs> So what I'm I'm thinking is either it is Monday or it is somebody named um Demet Dumet um who was inspired by Monday and all those that came before him. I mean he has a lot of Dumet stuff, but this person also has a lot of HH Holmes stuff, so he could just collect stuff from, from all of them, you know? Or it could be Monday. I don't know. Escape the garden. Kurt Hall, publicist. Hmm. What are these things called again? It has blood on it. Sundial. I don't know why I was thinking sand dial. And I was like, that can't be right. <laughs> I was close. Just had a little bit wrong. What if one of them is him? Oh god. What? No, no, don't go yet. Oh god. One of them is actually him. You son of a bitch. You son of a bitch! Ah. 
Oh my god. Run. God. Oh, come on. Please don't do this. Okay. All right. Oh, looks like Mark made it outside. Damn it. Jesus. That's a real hand. Kinda of weird that all these keys are hanging around so randomly. Huh? Or at least this one feels pretty random. But I guess I don't know. Is this guy all human? No, it's just mostly it's a... That's a, a mannequin, right? I don't know. I just feel like our killer here would have picked up the key after he was done with this guy. think you want to know I don't think that's a question you want to be asking mm -mm. what's that I don't know you probably knocking shit over because I can't fucking see a thing get this light. And Lewis Lee wedding ring. Ah! 
buffalo. Is that you? Fairy man? What the hell? In we go. I think my finger rolled across the... Oh my god. Maybe I was too late. They really need to stop putting stuff... Oh god, maybe he's okay. Maybe he's dead. I don't know. They really need to put st uh, stop putting things on the tail end of the rapid presses like that. That is not cool. They really need to stop that. I don't want this. I don't care about this. I don't know what this does for me. Okay, Charlie, you're Mark. my only hope. Hey, Mark. Where's Mark? He's dead. I think everyone's gonna die. Is there anything I could use? It's not showing me my uh, my item inventory in the bottom corner anymore. I don't know if it's glitched or what. I can't see it. Did I? I didn't change any settings. sure why uh, I don't know maybe that's it's supposed to be like that well he did have like a key uh, a, 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 a like a lock pick and like a card that he could use to open like little drawers and stuff. That's where we came out of. But maybe he doesn't have that stuff anymore. I can make that. The stuff dropped, but I couldn't see Mark's cameras or anything, and I he had a light. So maybe Mark doesn't have his cameras anymore, and I don't know. Doesn't matter, it's probably fine. Where am I taking this? Clearly not there. Oh, maybe there where the barbed wire is.
where there's no barbed wire. Careful. What the hell? Dog? What was that? <sighs> Seventy three cents. Almost got a dollar. What? What is what is going on? Hello? What's with the creepy creepies? Doggy's not a nice doggy? I'm gonna die to a dog. That would be really sad. Yeah, fucking fetch. Ah, <sighs> Charlie was chased by a dog. What? Well, okay. Mark found an R FBI card belonging to Agent Monday. Where do I go? There's so many different ways. I guess I could inspect this. I need to find Mark though. I don't want to like leave without him if that's possible. Worth a try. Waste of time. Okay. <laughs> 